dry center and come up a wet center. The only way we get saved is by being baptized into Christ. And then whether we get baptized into the Holy Spirit or baptized into the water next, it doesn't really matter which order that comes in. Should we do both of those things? Yes, we should. But do either of those last two, being baptized in the Holy Spirit or baptized in the water, save us? No. Being baptized into Christ. Now, let's take this as our foundation and let's move on. Let's not have to lay again the foundation of purifying and wonder, well, well, am I saved if I'm baptized? Am I this? No. You're not saved unless you're baptized into Christ. Now let's, let's move on. So let us move on now. And let's see where we're going. Let's go back to Ephesians, where our text scriptures are. And let's go to Ephesians chapter 4, verse 15. Now we're going to be moving into the more mature things of Christ. And some mysteries and some things that were hidden from the foundation of the world. So we're going to Ephesians chapter 4. Verse 15. <clears throat> well, I'd love to read into this, so then we'll, we'll just hear it one more time. Faith comes by what? Hearing. hearing and hearing and 